Hey everyone, today we're going to be crafting with one of our Christmas cutie toppers and this one is Merry Christmas, it's so cute. Okay, so what we're going to do with this one first of all is, I was totally inspired by this piece of cardstock and I had to do a little bit of fussy cutting. So I've already made a start on this. Um, so let me just have a little look where else we need to continue this. So just using our craft knife, we're just going to slip, uh, slip around the top of here just grabbing these little holly leaves and um, obviously taking your time there's no rush with this you can use your scissors if you prefer but i am more of a craft knife girl when it comes to sort of fussy cutting like this and i haven't been really detailed like i haven't gone in in between the berries and things like that here around the mouse i have cut around his tail but i haven't gone inside here haven't bothered with the branches and this extra leaf here so just look at your your work and see well do i actually need to cut that section out you know take do as much or as little as you can actually manage when it comes to fussy cutting so just grabbing all of the bits and pieces just taking care here while he's actually hanging by that branch because it is very delicate there and what we're going to do here is we have a six by six car blank and i'm just going to cut off a section at the top there because we're going to replace the front of this card with some acetate so i'm just going to bring our trimmer in and i'm just going to line that score up to one inch there and cut that section off pop the trimmer back away just give this a really good crease so we know it's sitting nicely there we're going to pop some tape on and then attach some of our snowfall acetate. It is an absolute essential when it comes to your Christmas crafting because it just adds so much more than just sort of regular acetate. It just really elevates that Christmas feel. So we've now got that card front made out of our acetate. We're then gonna use some more of that cardstock to go on the inside of here. So again, a little bit of matting and layering using our gold mirror because our topper um, on here is foiled with gold but we're actually only using the sentiment one sentiment from the topper sheet so if you think when we're talking about how many cards you can make with your blockbuster this is where you can really sort of extend it just using your cardstock for your sort of main images and then using your toppers elsewhere you're going to be able to make so many cards so this is going to go inside so again just grabbing that tape off the back of here so the holly is going to sit at the bottom so that when we pop our little um, mouse in, that's going to sit at the top. So we can bring that in and he is just going to sit at the top of here. So we've got a little bit of white showing here, which we will cover with our season squeakings. So cute. Um, so just get him in place now. So again, just a little bit of tape just taking care of just with the branch there because it is quite delicate so just pop in some tape here and here just so that we can secure this in place so we'll just grab these little bits and just making sure that tops nice and stuck first of all we can then go in and secure our little mouse I'm going to add our little seasons squeakings up there so let's get a little foam pad to pop that in place so he's just peeking out from behind there and then you can further embellish this with some gemstones and things like that if you want to but that is our gorgeous little mouse <laughs> 